not fun like cream cheese. I don't know how you lose cream cheese. I mean, I put it in the fridge when I go home. And now I can't find it. I've looked many times in both fridges and I just can't find it. So instead of trying out that recipe that I wanted to, I'm just going to make regular buttercream and decorate the frosting. So just butter and icing sugar. It, it, it'll do the same trick. I just really wanted to try the lemon frosting with cream cheese because that would taste so nice. But hopefully I'll find it. And if I don't, it's not the end of the world. Anyway, let's get to it. I just went and double checked how much butter I was actually putting in, just double weighted to check it was 250 because I was like, there's so much I'm going to faint. Oh my God. I swear to you vlog, I'm not going to eat any of these cupcakes. That's so much butter. And then you put so much icing sugar. It's like, oh God, no wonder I'm so big. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to not eat any and I'm going to go for a walk. Like seriously, that is, I'm not even going to eat them and do the walk. Like that's, wow. Because I had a couple of cupcakes the other day, so, or yesterday, so yeah. Definitely can just uh, go them to the neighbours and be like, no, there's no sugar in this at all. There's no butter in this at all. Please, go have them. <laughs> no, I won't do that. I just have to put um, this in the bowl. And and yes, I should have gotten pure icing sugar, but I guess I hope it doesn't make a huge difference. This is next time I'll buy pure icing sugar. So I need a lot of this, 625 grams. I don't have enough. Crap. I'm going to have to make half then. Oh well. That was my plan anyway. Alright, I've made a very small amount of buttercream. I feel like I should make another quarter recipe. Or maybe even two more quarter recipes. Because it's not a lot and it won't last me long. So I just figured I'd start with a quarter. And see how I go. But yeah, I'm just going to put the blue and the purple. In here, see my new two colors I got, so exciting! Yep, and I'm gonna go ahead and do that now. All right, I've dyed my colors and I'm pretty happy with the purple. The blue, I'm not sure if I'm happy with it. I'm not sure if I wanna add more or if I like it like that. You know, it's a nice light color, but it, it does get lighter, I think, so I'm not sure if I should add a little bit more. I think I'll add a teeny bit more color to that because it's not quite as strong as the purple. I think I'm pretty happy with that blue. I think it looks good. We'll see how it turns out on the cupcake. So I've got three new piping tips, but I think for today I'm just going to use these. I've only got two colours, so I have to eliminate one. And then, yeah, I think I'll just stick with these two for today. See what I can come up with. So this one I can do like a kind of border with. I think it would be good to have three, but then I just want to stick with blue and purple. So yeah, I'll just do these and see if I can recreate that little thing. Maybe not. I don't know. I might even later on just um, make more frosting and then I can use this one. So it's a bit hard to see the shape, but you can kind of do seashells with it. Like that. So yeah, it just looks like that. It's got like a yeah, razor kind of edge thing. Yeah, they're all cool, but I think I'll just stick with the red and the purple ones for now. <laughs> this is so ridiculous. Look at this. I definitely need to make at least another half quantity like that's insane that's all I've got I don't know what made me think that that would be sustainable I have a lot of cupcakes there I have like 13 so definitely gonna need to make more but that's all right that's not my best attempt but I tried. I'm still getting used to all this. Like this is all still very new to me, so bear with me. start putting my work that isn't the best on the internet but then I think hey I get to see my progress in video like if I keep practicing I'll eventually be really good and my progress can be you know captured in videos forever so that's pretty cool I guess you know thinking about it like that ah get off seriously there I have four blue and purple cupcakes yeah cool 
have a good look at these. See, they're not horrible. They're obviously not worthy for a customer, but they're not horrible, and I'm happy to keep practicing. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and make some more frosting, and hopefully by the time I'm done, my brother will be home so I can use his tripod. Because it would make filming things a lot easier. Alright, so I've got the leftover frosting from the other day, and I've got the new frosting that I made, and I'm going to just colour it a bit more, and I'm going to use these two nozzles today, because I've never, I haven't used this one. So I'm kind of excited for that. I'm going to decorate those cupcakes, and also I got more cream cheese, so I might actually make more cupcakes and make the frosting with the cream cheese just so I can use it up and yeah but for now I'm just going to use this brand new frosting which honestly looks really gross I know like before you color it and everything I think it looks really gross but it'll look nice when I'm done It's looking pretty good. This takes so long, it's cold. Oh, so, I'm pretty happy with these colours. Yeah, you got your purple and you got your blue. I'm pretty happy with that, so I'm going to go ahead and throw these into the piping bags and start piping. You can see the cupcakes in the background there. Ready to go. I've got too much frosting and not enough cupcakes to decorate so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, probably end this video now and I will make more cupcakes and decorate those so I'm not sure if I'll film it I might but I think you've seen enough of me decorating cupcakes so thank you guys so much for watching I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next one bye bye